Alright everybody, welcome to Town Center Mall here in Stafford, Connecticut for another fun, exciting, action-packed adventure of the Fitted Hat Pool. Now this is the hat I bought in the sports van. Uh, this is a one-size-fits-all New York Jets hat. So as you see here, it says New York Jets on the front. It's green all the way around, has the white stitching there. It says 47 brand over there. Uh, it says Jets back there. And, uh, there's a um, 47 brand on the in there, and there's a black sweatband on the in there on the inside. Now this I bought at um, the sports van, because, um, uh, well, I'm a Jets fan, and, and who knows when I'll get a chance to buy a Jets hat in Connecticut again. I don't know. Could be any time now. Who knows? Now. Uh, then now this is what I got at Liz. First I got this uh, Montreal Expos hat and there you can see the uh, Montreal Expos logo. The hat is uh, red, white, and blue. You got the New Era logo right there. It says Expos on the back. And uh, there's the uh, Expos Montreal baseball thing. It has an M, a B, and an E. And this is a large, extra, extra large. So on in here it says 39.30. Now I actually did see the Expos play in 1982 in Philadelphia versus Philly. They still have the ticket stuff. So uh, there's that. And my third hat purchase at the Town Center Mall here in Stanford, Connecticut is the Screaming Indians hat since they're planning on changing the name. Now this is um, right here. It says it has a circle and there's a C and Batterman logo, the new air flag. It's a 5950. This is seven and three fourths, so that means it's one size too big. Um, why did I buy a hat one size too big? Because Cleveland Indians hats are going to be going away because they're changing their name to the Cleveland Guardians, which I think is the biggest jerk off name ever. Um, I am fine with the name Indians. I know many people are not. I don't know if people get offended by everything. What are you going to do? Um, I would have bought a Redskins hat while I was at it because I like the I like Native American imagery. I, I like the logo. So, but it was adjustable, and I'm the fitted hat fool, which means all the hats are fitted. If I get an adjustable hat, well then I'm lying to you through hat, and who wants to do that? So anyway, in review, these are my hat purchases at the Town Center Mall here in Stamford, Connecticut. We have this Cleveland Indians hat, soon to be the Cleveland Guardians, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this red, white, and blue Montreal Expos hat. It's perfect for the 4th of July if you're up in Canada. Uh, so there's that red, white, and blue, of course. Uh, I'm hoping baseball comes back to Montreal. I don't know. Okay, who knows? And then this uh, New York Jets hat, which I bought this at the, the sports fan. The other two I bought at Wigs. So here those are. So uh, it's a nice Jets hat. It's one size fits all. And uh, I tried it on before I got it though, because sometimes that one size fits all, you might, you know, you get home and you're like, hey, it doesn't fit. Um, so I don't want to do that because then I got to come all the way back up to Connecticut to exchange a hat. I'm not going to do that. So um, anyway, thanks for watching. Tell your friends, tell your enemies, and tell your loved ones to click the uh, subscribe button and uh, you know tune in to the Fitted Hat Fool, where all the hats are fitted, and I'm the fool, and we're here at the post work in the Town Center Mall in uh, Stamford, Connecticut. I'm going to go back to charging my battery for a while, uh, so I have enough when I get over to the Jackie Robinson statue. It, it's charged up enough, but I want to make sure. Plus, I'm just getting off my feet because, uh, frankly, I'm old. Anyway, thanks for watching.